Um, we always felt that Madness were the naughty boys who did stuff that we weren't naughty enough to do. <laughs> were Madness a naughty band back in the day? <laughs> naughty boys from nasty schools. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I suppose up to a point, you know. I mean, it's hard now. You sort of regulate your memories, don't you? It sort of blanks out a lot of the really bad stuff. <laughs> well, let me help you out a bit. You were banned from Top of the Pops four times. I know. Indeed. <laughs> I think in this very studio. Unfortunately, our saxophone player took issue with the BBC and came on with a T-shirt that said, I need the BBC, and when the camera panned back around, the next T-shirt said, like a hole in the f***ing head. <laughs> <laughs> I can still hear the producer's feet coming down that metal staircase with his hobnail boots on. You're an embarrassment to yourselves, to the BBC. <laughs> Get out of it! That's a wild time where that was the biggest problem the BBC had. <laughs> There's a guy wearing a T-shirt, I'm like, yo, this is crazy! <laughs> <laughs>